Hey everyone, for this video I'm changing the drive shaft on my WL Toys 12428RC car. So I need to remove the metal ends, but if you're upgrading or changing yours, you might just be able to remove the metal ring and the internal pins and replace it with the new drive shaft. Uh, but as I'm replacing it with a different design for the drive shaft, I'll need to remove the metal parts as well in this one. So firstly I heated up the metal parts of the drive shaft near the grub screws to heat up the thread locker. If you have a stove top lighter it's easier, uh, also be careful not to melt the plastic parts nearby. Now that it's heated up enough, remove the grub screws on the top and bottom sides of the drive shaft if you can. But for mine I had to drill out some of the grub screws as the thread had stripped already. This took quite a while as I didn't want to damage the inner metal piece for when I'm reinstalling the new drive shaft. Hey everyone, just a quick prompt to subscribe if you enjoy these videos. Remember subscribing is free and you can always unsubscribe in the future.
Okay, now we've removed the old one, let's get to installing the new drive shaft. Now we'll start by putting on some Loctite or thread locker on the grub screws. Um, and once you've installed it all, leave it for normally about 24 hours to cure, but the specific Loctite that you have will say how long to leave it for, and enjoy!